What's up guys, Nandemo Guy. I hope you enjoyed the last video. Remaking those pages from Hackers was uh, was really entertaining for myself. Hopefully you guys got a kick out of the video as well. And if you stuck through to the end, you would have noticed that I was doing a little giveaway or a challenge, if you will. I had placed some various items throughout the movie and if you could name them all to me, uh, you would win. And uh, I have a winner, but I'm first going to show you all of the answers, uh, show you what was hidden in the video, and then uh, reveal who the winner was. So check out the video, guys. Nandemo guy. In the first scene from the video, there are actually four items. What's going on, guys? Nandemo guy. Starting from the left, the four most commonly used passwords are, of course, love, sex, secret, and God. Next. This is the X-Force comic from October 94, and on the back, there's a hacker's ad. I like the early version of the hacker's skull and cross phones. The jacket was pretty obvious. This is the same brand jacket seen worn by date in the movie. It's a 70s motorcycle jacket from an English company called TT Leathers, and can be hard to find. A future video will focus more on the costume. The JVC shirt is next. This is worn by Curtis in the movie, during the makeout scene and when he's commenting on the team's outfits. It's a goalkeeper jersey from 94, worn by David Seaman from the English Arsenal soccer team. In the next scene, we see the first of the released soundtrack CDs. Of the three, this is mostly made of tracks from the movie, though some are different mixes than the ones actually heard in the film. It's the best of the three in my opinion. The intro homage is unmistakable. I used Google Earth to start the flyover of Denver, and taught myself Blender to create all of the circuits. It took me roughly two weeks to create this intro, but was a really fun project. A few scenes later, we see the third of the soundtracks. The tracks are okay, but primarily not from the movie. It does however include a couple of songs written by Simon Boswell specifically for background music for the movie. Next was the one most commonly missed. These are vintage roller blade power blades used by Dade's character in the movie. They have original laces and wheels and were surprisingly hard to find. I counted the next two as one item. The Hackers Movie original DVD, as well as the Sony UMD version. It's fun to get different releases, as artwork and articles are different, some being official art, which was never actually seen in the film. Next is the second Hackers soundtrack CD. Of the three, this is likely my least favorite, but does include a couple tracks from the film. For those who stayed to the end, the laptop background may look familiar. During Dade's initial meeting with Acid Burn, there's a brief shot where the Zero Cool desktop can be seen. So hopefully you guys got a kick out of that. Um, this is something I like to do in my videos from time to time is hide little things, do challenges and giveaways and whatnot. So you always got to keep an eye out for the end of the video or things down in the description or uh, annotations that pop up, things like that. The winner uh, is a person by the name of Major Asalin. Uh, he is winning a custom pager. I'm nearly complete. I uh, just need to put the custom message in and the buttons, and this will be sent on its way. Uh, for anybody who really enjoyed the Hacker video or is, is a fan of the Hacker's movie, I do have two more videos coming up where I will be recreating uh, Dave Murphy's luggable computer from the beginning uh, and middle of the movie. I'm also going to cover... Uh, how you can recreate the jacket and uh, and show you some of the stuff I have in terms of the, the costume and stuff as well. So some really cool stuff for those Hackers fans out there. If you guys really just enjoyed the, uh, the reproduction process, um, if you guys are interested in seeing more reproductions, you know, shoot me a message, shoot me uh, something down in the comments, let me know. I'd be happy to, uh, to oblige and do some, uh, some additional videos for you guys. Uh, and I really do enjoy making things. So if you've got something on request, shoot it over. You never know. I might uh, pick it up and, and make that happen. So thanks again for watching, guys. Nandemo guy.